With yesterday's game rained out, the Yankees and Guardians are playing at 12 today. Aaron Judge here in the first inning. Look at the wind carry. This ball just kept going and going and going. Yankees don't score on the first, but look at the wind. This could definitely play a factor throughout the game, the day actually. And it didn't take long for that wind to affect the game. Again, Jose Ramirez hit this ball as hard as you can hit a baseball. And that wind gusting up there just pushed it foul. Both the Yankees radio announcers and the Guardians announcers said that the wind definitely affected it. And I agree, it definitely did. And here in the second, the Yankees really have an opportunity. Verdugo walks to lead off the inning. Then as Waldo Cabrera walks. And then Jose Trevino gets his second hit of the season, a base hit to left. Bases loaded, nobody out for Trent Grisham getting the start, and he hits into a double play. Yankees score a run, but you know those are the kind of innings where you'd like to put a crooked number on the board. And here in the bottom of the second, Guardians, I'm about to say Indians, the Guardians have two outs, Bo Naylor on first, and he just gets picked off. He took off way too early. And here in the third, Juan Soto leads off the inning with a walk, and then Aaron Judge hits a mile-high fly ball to center field. Soto going back to first base. Naylor is in his way, and Soto kind of gives him a little push here. But look at Josh Naylor. He has the mindset. As he's going down, he tags the bag. The Guardians challenge this play, and they win it. Juan Soto is out. Soto starts arguing that he was in his base path. But you know, I think that is a great play by Josh Naylor to actually be like, oh, shit, I'm falling, but you know what? I'm going to tag the bag. That's really cool. He just pushed him out of the way. He tagged the bag oh, the with his glove. glove.